Season 6 is winding down, but there's still quite a bit of change about to hit the battlegrounds. Hold on tight, things are about to get explosive. The first, which was teased all the way back in 6.1, is finally making its PUBG debut. The Panzerfaust is a rocket launcher with an effective range of up to 150 meters, and can only be found on Karakin. Sticky bombs aren't the only thing knocking down walls these days. The Panzerfaust is a single-fire weapon with very limited availability, and as you would expect, it's as challenging to aim as it is highly damaging. It also takes up one of your primary weapon slots, and doesn't allow for any attachments, so take your time and zero in on your target properly to avoid wasting that precious shot. One more thing, a powerful weapon like this has a pretty nasty backblast, so be careful when firing the Panzerfaust if someone's behind you. Or take an enemy out with the backblast for extra style points. Just make sure you don't let Todd fire it off in a crowded hallway. In fact, don't give it to Todd at all. The Panzerfaust is bound to add even more tension to the already tense Karakin. We're looking forward to seeing the crazy plays you all pull off with this one. We're also taking the end of the season to do a little weapon balance. The M249, the Tommy Gun, and the UMP45 are all seeing some changes. The biggest shuffle, perhaps, is the M249, which is now a world spawn weapon. Previously, you could only find the M249 in care packages, but we've updated its look and sound, added some attachment slots, and reworked its numbers a bit. Previously, the M249 held 100 rounds of ammo, but will now default to 75, and go up to 150 with an extended magazine. To help counter the gun's increased availability and capacity, we've increased its recoil and lowered the damage per bullet a bit. The Tommy gun hasn't changed much since launch, so we're giving it a little love this update with a damage increase, recoil reduction, and finally the ability to attach red dot and hollow sights. And last but not least in the balance hopper is the UMP-45. Since the swap from 9mm ammo, the UMP has dropped off a little in use, so we're upping its damage and bullet travel speed. For more detailed information on the gun rebalance, check out our full patch notes. Karakin is also now available for play in custom matches, but we've disabled the red zone option because the black zone is already part of the map. And one last thing, the global rule set for eSports mode has been updated to the 2020 version. The updated rule set has been set up based on new Erango, so try it out and experience PUBG like the pros. Season 6 has seen a lot of experimentation from us, but we're thrilled so many of you are enjoying Karakin and our other additions. There's some cool stuff on track for next season, but for now, train up with the new weapon and balance changes. Be sure to check out our patch notes for details on everything 6.3. Karkin action just got a little more explosive, so drop in and finish the season off with a bang.